The number one thing that I love to do is prevent disease. And preventing cardiovascular disease is why I went into cardiology. Now, getting people to prevent disease on their own is not an easy thing because it takes hard work even though most of it is free. And there really are four major things that I recommend to patients to prevent a heart attack. One is to eat better. Now, for a lot of people, they think they're eating pretty well and they get a salad and they put ranch on it and some eggs and a whole bunch of cheese. And basically what they've done is transform their salad into a cheeseburger. And that is not a helpful way. Really, it is a low-fat, whole food, plant-based, unprocessed diet. These days, it's actually very easy to do with readily available, inexpensive ingredients. Things like oats for breakfast and brown rice and beans and some vegetables for lunch with a beautiful salsa on top. That kind of a meal is an easy way to do it without a lot of trouble. So that's one. Two is exercise. 30 minutes of brisk activity a day that leads to breathlessness. And if you have orthopedic issues, swim. If that doesn't work, bike. Try a recumbent bike. Try an elliptical. If you have trouble with your legs, use an arm bike. Whatever you're able to do to get to breathlessness is the goal. Obviously, check with your doctor first. So that's two. The third thing is stress. So most people don't realize, but stress, especially in Western society, is incredibly high. People have all sorts of stressors from marriage to work to finances, everything. Spend 30 minutes a day, meditate, pray, be introspective, do yoga, whatever you have to do to let things go. Four and final, and this is an interesting one, most heart doctors never talk about love. But why does love associated with a heart? Because they really go hand in hand. And the data suggests that people who have supportive connections in life, a spouse, a family member, a dog even, they do better. They have less heart attacks. They survive heart attacks better. And believe it or not, there's an emerging field of science in medicine showing this exact thing. So to put it all together in a way that people can really remember, live like a poor crop farmer. Now that may seem strange, but it's pretty simple. Eat what you grow, be active your whole life, be one with the earth, be at peace, and connect it to others. That's it. And if you can do that, that is the best way to prevent heart disease.